obviously the story of this game Teasley very I mean you kind of don't think about it at the time you walk the first guy of the game and you just keep going oh, that's 15 in a row 18 in a row uh, just what what did you th think of him tonight it's just kind of how Rick pitches in general you know he's not a guy where he has a wipeout slider like Lopez or a changeup like Bywater he just makes pitches and consistently does that throughout the entire game and you know you look up and you blink and oh man like six zeros in a row or whatever he had you know he thrown up at one time and he does that outing after outing um, you know, he knows the type of pitcher that he is. He doesn't try to be anything over the top. He's just going to execute, um, and those are the results. Um, you hate to see a guy lose a no hitter on a defensive shift when the guy it counts as a hit, but he's just putting it in play over there. You know, it's it's one of those ones where sometimes even in a shift when they don't hit the ball into the shift, um, just by seeing the defense place that way, we're forcing him to do something that he's uncomfortable doing. Mm -hmm. Take a different type of swing, something like that, and you know. Yeah. It, it does. It's unfortunate that it works out that way. Um, but you know, for the most part, again, he's the he's the big thumper in the middle of their order. And um, you know, for the most part, we held the singles in the series. So uh, whether he was trying to do something different or not, I'm not really sure. But um, you know, he hadn't really burnt us. And so we're just kind of sticking with what had been working for us. And through the first half of the game, you guys weren't getting a lot of hits, but you were making the most of the opportunities you did have. And that was important. Well, it's one of those things we talk about, our, talk to our own pitchers about as far as we can't walk people. Can't give them free bases and defensively. And they had a pair of errors on the board. They had the handful of walks early on. And we made it count where, you know, this is professional baseball. If you give them free bases, they're going to make you pay. If you give them extra outs every half inning, they're going to make you pay, and that's kind of what happened tonight. Mike Early had a good night for you tonight, four hits. Mike Early has a lot of good nights for us. He's a talented baseball player, um, you know, and he's a professional. He goes, to, he goes to the plate, he has an idea, and as the season has progressed, I think even more and more for him, he's really understood kind of how we play baseball here in Southern Illinois. And, um, the, you know, once, you know, as he's really grasped that, he's, he's exploded for us. We knew coming into the season we had a special player, but um, it's really fun to watch him play the game every night. Very good. Welcome to People's National Bank, Big John. Now, Big John, we know you've been a People's National Bank customer for years, but I bet you didn't know about the newest addition to the People's National Bank accounts. It's called Cha-Ching Checking. It's a free checking account with rewards. You can earn rewards or interest. And there are no monthly service fees and no minimum balance to earn rewards. Would you like to sign up? You would? And I see you've brought your friends to sign up too. Bring your friends to sign up for a Cha-Ching Checking Account. Free checking with rewards at People's National Bank and see what family-owned banking is all about.